In this short demonstration, I'll show you how to add a YouTube video to a Wikispace page. I'm here on YouTube, and I want to find a video on the Grand Canyon. So I'll type that into the search box. This is the video that I'm interested in right here, the very first one, the Grand Canyon Skywalk. And the video will begin to play. I've already previewed it. I know this is the one that I want. Over here to the right is the embed code, and this is what I need to copy. However, I do want to show you one thing. Notice at the bottom where it says Related Videos, this person has also made a video called Nude Beach Exposé. Well, what's going to happen is at the end of the video, little uh, thumbnails of these videos is going to show up along with the titles, and I don't think you want your students to click on this one that says Nude Beach Exposé. So next to the embed code, there's a link here that says Customize. And when I click that, right here, this radio button is, uh, has selected Don't Include Related Videos. So that's what I want to do. I want to exclude those related videos from popping up at the end. So now I can go back in here. Once I click inside the box, it's highlighted. I can either right-click and say Copy, or I can use Control-C. All of this code, which I know nothing about, has been copied. Now I'm going to go over to my Wikispace. First thing I need to do is click on Edit This Page, and that brings up the toolbar. The tool I'm looking for is the one that looks like the TV set, and it says Embed Widget. When I click on that, here's a choice of the different types of applications I can use, and I want to do Video. So I click on Video, and some of the most popular video sites will pop up automatically, and I was on YouTube, so I'll select that one. And here's my instructions. I've already done this part. I went to YouTube. I looked for the embed code. I copied it. Now what I need to do is either right-click and paste, or hit Control-V, which will also paste it, and then I say Save. Now, right now, nothing's showing up. All I have is a gray box that says YouTube. I still need to save this page, so I'll click the Save button. And now, on my wiki page, is the video of the Grand Canyon Skywalk that I copied from YouTube. Here are the last few seconds of the YouTube video that I selected. You notice at the very end of the movie, you will not see the related videos. The only button the students will see says Replay. But if the students click inside this window, it will take them to the YouTube site. The video will begin to play again. And over to the right, you will see the related videos, including the ones you don't want your students to see. So the moral of the story is, select your YouTube videos carefully. You're never sure what related videos are going to show up. They may not be appropriate for your students. So you'll want to preview that very carefully when you select your videos.